Get this milkweed going. Give me my sunglasses. Grow, my mighty milkweed. Grow! Where's some more milk? Your boy needs more milk. Is there no milk nearby? Oh, it's literally right behind me. Thank you. Ah, there's another bonus. Hello. All right, these crates, whenever it's a milkweed crate, they normally give you, like, a chunk of money. Uh, only, like, ten, but money is still money. All right, time to beat Otis again. Uh, destroyed. There we go. That was, like, 50 coins right there or something along those lines. Not bad. All right, we got, like, 70 coins out of that, using that milkweed there. It's not bad. Where'd my bike go? I highly doubt that the crates in the junkyard are going to give me a lot of money. I bet you they still only give like one or two coins. I'm not going to bother going back. Oh, here we go. I wanted to do this just to see how much this gave. Hit this up. Collect the coins. That's what I'm going to try and do. What on earth is chat? Do you see that jump section right there? I'm going to screw that up so hard. Oh, dear. Yep, yep, that's fine. This actually is not that bad so far. Going a little slow, but what are you going to do? Is this going to be like 200 coins or something? It's going to be a lot. Oh, it's going to be so close. It was 200. I only got 185. But now that I know it, I think I can do it better, and I'd rather do this one than the uh, the other one, to be honest, because 200 is a large number. Larger than 150. I think I still have, like, don't I have, like, two more tokens? We can probably get the majority of the money we need right here, which is great to hear. Should have been doing this one the entire time instead of the golf one that was, like, 150. I think I have two more of these coins. Collect those coins. It's really just that jump part that's difficult. Everything else is pretty easy as long as you can do the balancing act. This part right here. Pull this off and then pull off the jump in your set. That's fine. Honestly, I don't really know how to pull that off without falling. But it's A-OK -okay because I still get plenty of cash. Oh, yes. Oh, we're going to get them all this time. Easy. We're going to be over 1,500 when I do this one more time, assuming I do have one more uh, token like I think I do. Get the sprint bike. I'm, I'm on the sprint bike as far as I'm aware. This is the best bike in the game, I'm fairly certain, unless they unlock, like, there's a, a fourth bike you can buy after you uh, finish the main game, maybe. But I'm also, like... I need 700 more coins to finish the playthrough. I'm not going to buy a bike for no reason. Ah, oh, dang it. I don't have any more. That was my last one. Whatever. Do, do, do. All right, we just need 638 more. Something like that. May as well break these while I'm here. I think, even though I wanted to try to avoid it, we're going to have to go get a little more honey. Because we do need a small chunk of change to get the amount we need. I don't think I've talked to Root in a little bit. Maybe Root has another gold rush token or two for me that I can use. Because I'm pretty sure we bought like two or three more things since we talked to him last. You know what? Give me all these bluebells right here, because there are a ton of them right here. And uh, we'll be able to sell bunches of these to the gophers tonight for like 20 a pop. Yeah, fork them all over. Give me all these bluebells. This right here is a full 20 coins on its own. Yeah, there's two bunches. That's 40 bucks. Got three normal bluebells. Not bad. All right, let's go this way. 
we are just 625 away, boys. If Root gives me one and or two gold rush tokens, we're basically set. We're nearly there with the 200 pointer we can do now. Let's go up here and get some honey because everything of honey is 50 bucks with the cream and lemon, which we still have a handful of, I think. So we're going to get all three things of honey here. I'm hoping I can get enough money right now during the day so that like when I cycle tonight, I'll either have enough or I'll be able to get enough by just selling stuff. That is the ideal that I'm hoping for right now. Definitely stealing three things of honey will go a long way towards making that happen. Oh, we still have all of that ice that we haven't used to make drinks, don't we? I think we had like 14 things of ice. That's gonna be like, uh, that's gonna be like uh, 140 coins right there. That's easy. I think if we get the three things of honey here, go make the three of the uh, lemon pies or whatever that gives like 50 coins and then we cycle to nighttime and make as many drinks as we can then we can just go and sell enough stuff to be able to buy everything we need we, we basically got it you just gotta wrap up the last bit of this money gathering almost screwed that up something fierce I'm leaving I'm leaving leave me alone and then I I think I'm gonna we're probably coming up on about two hours now. Should be around two hours. I think I'll play Hyrule Warriors for like two more hours, to be honest. I mean, it's a Saturday. I don't want to do a two-hour Saturday stream. I'd rather do like a four- or five-hour one. Then we'll do a four-hour stream tomorrow. And uh, then we'll just be a few days away from Tokyo Mirage. I gotta let these bees pass by. Do. Kes would probably love a Pokemon Mystery Dungeon a lot if you could play as Shroomish as the main character. I mean, I don't really care. I do like... I, I'm going to be honest with you. Shroomish is cool, but it's really Breloom that I like. And Pokemon Mystery Dungeon you can't evolve in. So honestly, like, having to play as Shroomish for the whole game sounds like it would be a hassle. And actually, I'd rather just play as, like, Turtwig. Or, uh... Usually, Totodile is pretty good in Mystery Dungeon games. He learns a decent, uh... I'm pretty sure Totodile can learn, like, Crunch and everything. You can get a Shroomish and play as a Shroomish in Sky, but you can't have a Shroomish be the main character in Sky, I'm fairly certain. He's not one of the main character options. We were talking about playing as a main character, not just being a playable Pokemon. Time to go. Uh, do you guys see that? I've never seen that until now. That's uh, a little strange that that exists there. There's just a statue of what appears to be Otis, or maybe just a cow in general. Alright, one more thing of honey. Normally I only get two, but I'm getting this third one to make sure we have enough money to wrap this up. Here we go. Last one. Oh. Get running, get running, get running. Oh, there's a hiding thing right next to it. It's not like... Oh, no, no, that's not the... I thought the honey was right here. Here's the honey. This is still fun. <laughs> Give me another. I need to get three in one go, please. There we go. Perfect out of here. Did you see those bees like teleport at the very end? They were about to hit me with the nothing personnel kit. Cass, what's your favorite Pokemon song? What do you mean when you say song? Do you mean soundtrack or do you mean like from the anime like the openings? Because like my favorite soundtrack is probably uh what is the it's called Fight to the Finish isn't it? The primal Dialga music from Explorers of Sky? It's probably, like, the best track in Pokemon history. It's definitely, like, up there, if nothing else. There we go. Alright, that'll do it. We have cleaned this place out of honey, and we are good to go. Let's go make some lemon pies, and then cycle it on to nighttime, and see if we got enough cash to buy everything. Bow, bow, bow.
bam, bam, bam. Soundtrack? Fight to the Finish, she explores the sky. I think it's called Fight to the Finish. The Primal Dialga boss music, you know what I'm talking about. It's probably the best piece of music Pokemon has ever put out. Although Pokemon does have several good, uh, several good OSTs. Good old Gopher Hill right here. No, that's the wrong way. Yeah, here we go. Over the bridge. Another one I really like is I really like, I think it's the Elite Four music in, I think in Sun and Moon. It was like probably, honestly, for me, it was like my favorite thing in Sun and Moon because Sun and Moon was pretty bad overall. But I really liked the Elite Four music in Sun and Moon, if I remember right. And I, uh, a YouTuber called Falcone who does uh, a bunch of, um, he does a bunch of like symphonic metal covers of video game music and sometimes anime stuff as well. Uh, he does a lot of stuff about, he did Godzilla stuff too. He just does symphonic covers of like everything. But uh, he did a cover of that and it was really, really good. I loved it. I'm gonna make something swill. Please do. Perfect. Give me uh, two more of those, please. Hey, let's cook. Let's cook indeed, my friend. One more. Oh, whoops. Remove. Spamming the button too fast. I'm gonna make something swill. Gen 5 has a lot of really good music, too. Like the plasma battle music. Get Oh, Getsis' music is one of my favorites. I love Getsis in... Uh, they, like, have a remix of it in Black and White, too, which is also good. But the original Getsis music from Black and White. I love the Getsis fight music in Black and White. And then Black and White 2 has a great plasma. The plasma fight theme is really good. Just the normal plasma grunts. Gen 5 probably has the best soundtrack overall of the main series. Counting side games, probably Sky has the best soundtrack. Explorers of Sky does, I would say. All right, we only need a little under 500. 475. I'm going to cycle tonight. So uh, we're actually going to jump in the barn real quick to see if Root has anything for us. And we're also going to uh, turn all of, our, all of our ice into ice waters, which is worth 20 bucks a pop. And then we're going to go and sell whatever we... We're literally going to just sell, like, everything to the gophers to get enough money to buy what we need. That is the plan. And then we should we should be set. Should be able to wrap it up. Root does not have anything for us, unfortunate, but whatever. This place really is packed. Are you hungry? <laughs> oh, uh, just asking. <laughs> just asking. This Oh no, it's three ice is twenty bucks, not two ice is twenty bucks. What was I saying earlier? I didn't know what I was talking about. So we're gonna get a little less here than I expected, but that's fine. Mm, it's still good. Actually, wait a minute, go back. What uh what do I have here? Don't have honey. Anything that needs honey, I can't do. Ice lemon tea might be better. I don't have much lemons left though. Apple cider? Yeah, let's try apple apple ice. See what that gives us. I was about to say, do I not have any friggin' apples? I'm Seems right. unlikely. I like Pig as a doctor instead of a cook. He's multi-talented. He can do both. We got a new drink. Also worth 20. Whatever. But I have more apples than ice, so this we is going to get us drink. a little more money overall. Bow. We got a new drink. We got a new drink. I say new, but we made it literally just a minute we got ago. A new drink. He just says the same thing every time. How does his tail never move? He's so skilled. We got a new drink. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready to pick. I'm ready to be the number one party animal and to play some Hyrule Warriors. Uh, Bad luck. Oh well. Down the hatch. Did I put in the wrong stuff? I'm mistaken. You know what? Just do got a new drink. these three ices. Or these two things of three ice to get the ice water and then we'll call it there. We should be close enough. Ah, uh, yeah, I really don't want to be short, so do this instead. We got a new drink. Just to be safe. His tail moves so fast, it looks like it's standing still. Mm, 
refreshing. Refreshing indeed, my friend. Let's Two mix. more drinks to go. But an ale. Ready. We got a new drink. You did apple ice ice for the failed one? Yeah, that sounds like me. Refreshing. Yes, I want to leave the bar. Thank you. Snack. All right, we should be close enough on money that I can just sell random stuff until we have enough, hopefully. If not, I'm going to lose my mind. But I really hope we do so that we can call everything to a close without any issue. Oh, we need 315. That's a hefty chunk of money. I don't know. I better grab some flowers on the way to have some more bunches to sell, I think. If I just had one more gold rush token, we would have been set. Mind the step. I don't think there's a step. Thoughts on Sword and Shield DLC? I talked about it a lot the other day. I'm not going to talk about it again. But it basically just boils down to I don't care and I'm still not playing the games. What if they made a new or remastered an old Pokemon Ranger for the Switch? I'd probably play it. I really like the Pokemon Ranger games. I'm a big fan of them. More Oxide Daisies over here. I'm just grabbing as many flowers as we can because every 10 flowers of the same type is 20 bucks. And 315 is a, a little more... We're lacking a little more in the money department than I expected, unfortunately. <laughs> Apples, I think, are also only worth one buck, but to be honest, give me them. I'm going to sell literally everything that I can to make this happen. Break all these. I'm pretty sure the Switch is touchscreen if it's not docked, yeah. If I'm not mistaken. I believe it is. But also, I mean, probably the way they'd do it is they'd have you do, um... They'd have you do it like in The World Ends With You on the Switch, where you, uh... Use the Joy-Cons like a Wii Wiimote and just point at the screen to do it. I imagine is how they'd make it work for Ranger. Because otherwise you couldn't play it when docked. And that would suck because I can't record my Switch unless it's docked. Why are you making that noise? Stop making that noise. It's terrible. I told you, chat, that when we got to this point, I would nickel and dime to the last bit to make sure I got all the money I needed. Switch his touchscreen when not docked? Thought so. Do I max out on apples? You can only carry 20 at a time. Do I get up to 20? I am now. All right, well, here we go. Let's see if I have enough stuff to sell that I can get up to... I can get uh, 300 coins here. I'm going to grab these daisies right here. I really wish that the gophers did message me again to be like, hey, give me something at night for more money, because then I'd feel a lot more confident. Yeah. Really, one short of another bunch? Really going to do me like that video game? I mean, I, I'll go get more if I end up needing more money, but still. What's up, Joey? Any chance you want to give your boy a discount on uh, one of these last three items I have to buy? You always say that, but it's always the same stuff every time. Jukebox, PA speakers, all that's left is the neon dance floor. We just need a little more money, just a tad bit more. Sell all of these carrots, just literally sell everything. All these melons, they're like really cheap and don't give a lot of money, but I'm selling literally everything. Ah, oh, cherries are worth two bucks, that's good to see. Lemons are worth four. What the heck? Everybody I can get lemons easily. And in fact, I'll probably go get lemons to get enough money if I don't get enough here. But I think I think we're going to get enough. Oh, chocolate is worth five? We're good. We're going to get enough money. Oh, easy. There, over a thousand. Buy my neon dance floor. Let's go. He's done it. I bought everything. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. Do, 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 do. Welcome to Stream Outer Orbit. 
What did you miss? Literally, like, the entire end of the game. Where we, we finished everything, except I just... In fact, we just finished everything because I bought the last thing. All I have to do is go up here and be crowned the number one party animal, and then we're done. It's all over. Let's go put everything where it goes and call the playthrough to a close, chat. Where's the survive news? Survive doesn't exist anymore. We're never going to get it. Everyone's welcome. Except for raccoons and coyotes. Do, 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 do. Come on, let me in. Number one party animal. Let's go. I've done it. I am the greatest. What's up, Root? The joint's really jumping now. The barn is now 100% complete. The horses love that neon dance floor. Makes them want a boogie. Here, take this milkweed. Thank you. I don't care about finding the rest of the milkweed spots, by the way. It doesn't mean anything to me. We're done as far as I'm concerned. You are a party bachelor. The barn is now 100% complete. The chickens really love the live music we got going here now. Thanks for fitting out the stage with the piano, lights, PA, and posters. Here, take this milkweed. Yeah, whatever. So you keep telling me. The barn is 100% complete. The goats love the jukebox. They turn up the music and play it all night. Here, take this gold rush token. Wish you would have given me that a little earlier, but whatever. It's my main cow. You are the party master. You know it, Root. This place is now decked out 100%. Our work here is done. Come on up on stage with me. The people owe you some love. Hit me up. Ladies and gentlemen, I want y'all to give it up for the super cow. Oh, what the heck? Loading screen. What do you say we Oh, it takes you back through the No, 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 no. I don't Yeah, skip that. There's something funny about that farm. I know there is. You can't fool me. No, sir. Man, she's glitching through that chair something fierce. <laughs> they actually show you that scene again. I would like to say thank you. All right, there it is. There it is. For those of you watching on YouTube, I hope you enjoyed this playthrough of me going back down memory lane and playing a game from my childhood. It was a lot of fun. Uh, you saved the farm. Come back and visit whenever you like. Load your game to continue playing. Thank you. Uh, for those of you on Twitch, I'm still going. I'm going to play some Hyrule Warriors after this, so don't go anywhere. But uh, we're done with Barnyard. It's finished. I enjoyed playing through this game. Uh, we ended it at, like, the perfect time because now uh, Tokyo Mirage Sessions comes out in, like, six days. So perfect time to end this playthrough. Um, it lasted literally exactly as long as I hoped it would. But, yeah. For those of you who watch on YouTube, if you want to catch me playing other games, I plan on playing other games from like this from when I was younger in the future. Like, uh, I want to play the Madagascar game, I want to play the Tank and the Power Juju games, the Spongebob movie game, etc, etc. I want to go back to a lot of the cartoon-esque games that I played when I was young and play them on Twitch and move them to YouTube. So, if you want to catch anything like that live or any other games I play, don't open up a cutscene. Any of the other things I play live, there is a link to my Twitch channel in the description, or you can keep watching on YouTube. I appreciate the support either way, and I hope you enjoy the playthroughs. Until next time, farewell.